Morning everybody, not your normal Rocky Mountain School of Photography video, but we have a special day for the professional intensive students today. Um, they've got a lot of shooting, a lot of learning time that's going to happen, so I wanted to document that and show you guys what a day, granted a hand chosen day that I think would be really cool to show uh, what a day in the professional intensive student life is. So we'll talk more about PI through this video, but right now i got to get to school at 6.30 a.m., call time's at 7, so i got to go make sure I'm there to get everything ready. But anyway, follow along for the ride today. We're going to look at a day in the professional intensive student's life. Let's do it. So before we get into the actual like action of it, I wanted to take a quick second and pop up here into one of our classrooms to tell you guys a little bit more about what professional intensive is and why this is a big day. Um, so PI, for those of you who don't know, professional intensive is our eight month career training program. And for those of you who've only watched our YouTube channel, we're a school, that's what we do. So Rocky Mountain School of Photography is an in-person photography school here in Montana. We get students from all over the country learning with us and they basically spend eight months learning here in the school. Um, all about starting a business with photography. We have 24 students here right now. They've been with us since September. And this day is a big day because we have a commercial photographer named Mike Tittle, who's also a, uh, he's a fantastic photographer. He's also a graduate of our program from way back in the 90s. And he comes and basically shares his wisdom for two weeks with the students. So PI is basically an eight month long, super intense, 40 hours plus per week, photography business and marketing training program to get people very quickly from zero to professional photographer or having the skills to be a professional photographer. It's a hard career, right? We can't just like say, you graduate and magically money will fall upon you. Um, but that's the idea of the program. So today's shoot is this morning, we're gonna have a demo with Mike shooting and we're basically, the students are gonna be seeing Mike shoot. He's shooting an athlete. We're gonna basically be seeing that whole experience happen. And then this afternoon, the students are shooting. So they're gonna head over to a gym. We've rented out racquetball courts and bringing all of our lighting gear over. And the students are gonna basically take their turn doing it. So that's the idea of the day. Let's go ahead and get started. So what you all have been seeing so far has been uh, all of the pre-setup stuff. So basically um, the way Mike works, and we're basically just kind of being an extension of Mike Tittle at this point because we want the students to see the way that Mike works. So uh, call time 7 a.m. Everything gets set up, everything gets built, everything does that. You, the truck that you saw roll up, that is a, a grip truck, basically a local uh, film production grip truck guy. His name's Tyler, he's absolutely fantastic. Um, I linked him in the description as well. You guys should check him out if you're ever in Montana doing video or photo production. He's one of the best um, there is, kind of the only actually. He's a great guy. So anyway, get everything set up. Models just arrived at 7.30, which they're right on time, so that's awesome. So now we're actually gonna start shooting and capturing images. Um, and taking test shots, things like that. A shoot like this is a really long thing. It's not like, you know, a couple shots and done. A lot of work goes into this. You can see we got to get Tyler scheduled, models scheduled, students here at the right time, students building all the gear. So we'll be shooting for a few hours. Um, the board that you all saw with the photos, that's the mood board. So that's kind of the idea behind this shoot, what Mike is trying to capture. Um, you saw Jeff, another familiar from the YouTube channel. He is the, um, you know, he's our, our staff instructor here at the school. He's fantastic. He is kind of playing art director in this shoot. So anyway, we'll get back to it. I just wanted to explain some of the stuff that you all just saw there real quick.
right, so we are about midday right now. It's about one o'clock. Um, they just finished up the demo shoot. Mike shot a few more scenes after you guys saw that, a few more things with the kickboxers. And now we had a lunch break and now we're headed over, or I'm already here at a gym, a local gym in town where we are doing a student shoot. So basically, we're at a racquetball, set of racquetball courts. There's five courts. We've rented all five courts for the students. We've got models, we've got the grip truck. Tyler has moved his grip truck over to this new location. So the students have all the grip, all the lighting gear. We packed it all up and now they are gonna be shooting for the next few hours. We've broken everyone up into groups and basically when one person's shooting, that shooter has two students who are assistants for them and then they swap through different models, different things like that. This is where the students have total creative control over the situation. So they're in a racquetball court, they have the given model that we give them, but from there they have to make the images their own. So we'll see the beautiful stuff that our students come up with right now. Take you guys inside. All right, you all, so there's a little flavor of the students shooting. They're gonna be broken up into groups, like I said, and they're gonna keep shooting for the next like five hours or so. They're gonna finish at 7 p.m. tonight. So literally went from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m., a full 12 hour day. Not every day is like that, uh, but some of them are, and it, it's definitely an intensive program. Uh, but that's a little flavor of what professional intensive is all about. It's a hands-on training program for eight months, very intense, 40 hours a week with over 25 working professionals. Now, those of you who will probably never take PI or who probably don't wanna become professional photographers, feel free to click away on this video. What I wanna do right now is talk to those of you who do and just give a little bit of advice because I've, I've seen a lot of people uh, come through this school and, and there's some good things that I think I can kind of give to those of you who are aspiring to do this. The first thing is this, don't let anyone tell you that you have to go to school and RMSP is included in that. Uh, you do not have to go to school for photography. I'm the first one to say that. If you are a really, really motivated individual and you work extremely hard and you're willing to do the research and hustle and grind and put in the time, you will become a successful photographer. What school does is it makes that process go faster from zero to professional. Shaves like five years off of that journey in a lot of cases. And so if you're trying to accelerate that, then going to a school can make some sense. Now, why is RMSP different? Well, what we're doing, we're not a college, we're not a four-year school. You don't learn math at RMSP, you learn photography and business and marketing. And so what we've done is we've basically taken more photography, business and marketing than you would get in a four-year program cut the gen eds out of it and packed it all into an eight month time frame and teach you with over 25 different instructors, most of whom are professional photographers. And that's really the way to summarize it is, uh, this is a program taught by photographers for photographers. And that's the whole idea behind it. We also teach video too, but video and photo are so intertwined that you don't need that much specific video training if you're also a trained photographer. So anyway, I guess the big question is, do you need to go to photo school? No. Will it accelerate your becoming a professional? Yes. Do you still need to be a highly motivated individual, whether you go to photo school or not, in order to succeed in this hobby or career? Yes, you have to be motivated. Um, and that's the big thing, you have to love it. Because you all, here's the, the, the truth of it is, our instructors who come spend a week in this program, they're here teaching eight hours a day. They then go home and work on their businesses, their photo businesses for four hours before they go to sleep. It is a rigorous career choice. So money's not gonna pour down upon you. Education will speed up that process. You gotta be a highly motivated individual. But with all that said, if you love photography and it's really what you wanna do, you can definitely make a career out of this. We see it every single year with people, whether it's in the retail world doing weddings or portraits or things like that, or the commercial world doing like, you know, advertisement shooting or editorial work or whatever it happens to be. Photography is totally something you can do. Anyway, I'm not a professional photographer. Just talk to a lot of them. I've seen a lot of them grow. I've helped teach a lot of them, um, but I just think it's worth uh, just giving you little tidbits of, I don't think you could call it wisdom, but more like advice. Anyway, hope you all like this video. I know it's kind of a little out of the ordinary, but hit that like button if you like this. By the way, this is the first like vlog style video I put up here since the building reveal or building uh, guide, not guide 
building vlog. <laughs> if you like this, hit that thumbs up button. I'd really appreciate knowing that you like this style of video because I'm happy to do more of them. If you didn't, you know what to do. If y'all have a question about the school or want to check us out, I've put links to our website down in the description. You can also leave a comment. I'll get back to you there. Lastly, hit subscribe to stay up to date for future videos. We have reviews coming down the line, some tutorials, a lot of exciting stuff. So definitely hit subscribe, stay up to date. I will see you all in the next one. Thanks for watching.